What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is something that I've been meaning to do for a while. I'm kind of taking on a bunch of different little projects. I've already filmed this video and my intro got deleted. This was my last day filming and I thought that I would come in and say what's going on. <laughs> As you guys know, I moved into a college house with four of my best friends or if you guys didn't know that, that's where I am right now. And I took on the project of organizing our pantry, bathroom that I share, my closet, and our office space, and I am working with the container store to do so, which was so fun and exciting. This is my first time living somewhere where the container store is nearby, so it has been really fun. But yeah, we just wanted to get our college home in order before school starts in the fall, except we, this week, some of us have found out the news that either all of our classes are online or some of our classes are online. So we also have been like perfecting our little office space. It's definitely not ready, but that's like an ongoing project, so yeah. I'll show you guys what I got from the container store, show you guys us getting our life in order, and yeah, our office space is really cute, but that'll be at the end. That's what I just finished doing, so. But again, if you guys have not subscribed already, make sure to do so, because we have lots of fun vlogs coming in this house, and this is just the beginning where I'm getting our ish together. So roommate right here, didn't I? Yeah. Is yeah, it not organized? Oh, you got it all together. It was incredible. Proof. Okay, let's get into the video. Hello. It is the next day. As no, I don't know if you can tell. Okay, wait. Should I put it there? Yeah. Okay. Hello. It is the next day. We're on our way to the container store right now. I'm here with Kirsten, my beloved roommate. We are here, the happiest place on earth. Doing curbside pickup because Texas is not doing too hot with coronavirus. If you guys have read the news, <laughs> I'm about to turn type A. Oh, I know. Like our. Kirsten Inner. here, my roommate. Okay, wait, it's not focused. She is type A. She is organized. She I, on the other hand, like, B. I'm type B, I'm type C, I'm like, a don't get B me wrong. I'm not like a hoarder. I'm not dirty, but at no, the yeah. same time, You're very minimal. I could, I'm very minimal. I could have something on my floor for like weeks and it wouldn't bother me. Like, I just like, I don't care. Should play some tunes. Okay. Guys. I'm I've, ready. Have y'all been listening to the playlist? I plugged it before and I'll plug it again. Our summer 20 playlist oh, on Spotify. I'll link it below. Thank you for calling the container store. Here we have, this is a good one. This is my favorite song. Okay, good. If you're gonna tell them everything, tell them I'm a good kisser. Tell them all the things you told me. Take me to your best friend's house. Go around this roundabout. I decided I'm gonna put on my mask and go in there real quick and just tell them tell them that I'm here because I don't know if I did it right on the website and I'd rather just go get it. So I'm gonna tell them that I'm here and then they'll load up my car. All right, they just brought everything out and I look like I am set. We got a bunch of, okay, I'm not gonna show you here. You will see soon. But they brought it out and it was super easy. But here we go. But this down here is what we are going to conquer first right now. So I got this thing, which I hope fits underneath the sink. It says that it's expandable, so hopefully I can figure it out. Yeah, I'm hoping this fits down there and then that'll be the first thing that I do. All right, I just assembled this little shelf thing and I was kind of hoping that I would have room to put like two different shelves because that's how it is on the model. But this cabinet's just not tall enough for that. But I really like this because now you can pull it back instead of having to like reach back there because this cabinet's pretty deep and it's like inconvenient to always be reaching all the way back there. So this will be mine. This is a little shelf and then LJ can have this little slide out basket. But it was really easy to assemble. So there is progress on that. Now my next task is putting all of this and stuff from underneath the cabinets into this organizer. We have now moved on to the pantry, but it's a bit of a more challenging task than I expected. Say hi! I don't know. <laughs> so I showed you guys our pantry before. This is it. We are both trying to take out what's ours, but there's only two of us here right now. It's kind of hard. We don't want to be like throwing random stuff out and all that. So I don't even know how to start with this. This is such a task. We have these little shelf things I wanna put spices on and like baking stuff. I have these baskets I wanna put snacks in. And then this for like cereal and stuff. But then once you look at it, there's just so much stuff. I couldn't think 
think of the word. We made the executive decision to take everything out because that's just the easiest way to organize stuff. Look at this so far. I've decided on doing a whole basket of baking stuff. We were just on the website and these are actually stackable. I don't know how I didn't catch on to that. What we're gonna do is take out a cabinet or two, probably just one, so we can put more in space in between these all and stack them. Also, I need to do another trip to the container store to get more, so, because I still have it in my closet. Like move it up a little. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, after taking literally everything out and finding like what was old and what we didn't need anymore. By the way, why we had so much stuff is because this one came from an apartment where she had everything. We didn't like just buy it for the house. So I threw out what was old and everything and this is what it looks like so far, which I'm very proud of because the before and after is insane. We have this little spinning wheel right here with like collagen, cacao powder, stuff like that. Then this has tuna packets, spirulina powder, and matcha, kind of random, but just some packets in there. Then we have some collagen peptides, emergency, and then crystal light. Sorry, the tapping of the nails might be annoying. But I'm just gonna keep those stacked right here because it's easy to get. Sauces, peanut butter, stuff like that. Again, a lot of this is probably gonna change. I just wanted to get like a good idea of how I'm gonna organize everything. We're all gonna have our own stackable baskets. So this is one person's food, this is Kirsten's, and then they're actually back ordered at our store, but once they come back in stock, I'm gonna get more of these. This little spinny wheel, which is really convenient. It's a bunch of cooking stuff. And then down here is the area that I need to finish. We have a lot of baking stuff and I wanna get little containers for like the flour, the sugar, and stuff like that. But anyways, I am going to finish this tomorrow when I do my second round. I'll have my closet and everything done. But all right, it is the last day of this organization project that I have taken on. I am about to run to the container store because I did like a first run and that's where I got the pantry stuff and then all of that. Then I kind of wanted to been connected. Like I wanted to wait and see what we still needed. But I'm gonna actually go into the container store today because last time I did curbside pickup because you know COVID. But I have my mask and I have my hand sanitizer and last time there was like no one really in there so I feel safe going if that makes sense. This is so fun, I'm just already so distracted, so. If you guys watched my dorm video where I said how to make stuff cute, I was really big on baskets and I did not realize how many the container store has. So, if y'all are looking for baskets, you know the place. These do look cool, I just feel like I would not use them properly. I really wish I could customize my closet like this, but doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Okay, it's my round two trip and I am very excited and very impressed. And now I'm gonna go home and organize the rest. Okay, so I think yesterday I might have said that it was the last day of our organization projects, but that was not true. I forgot about our office, which is actually like the most important, and that is what I want to get most set up because a lot of us have online classes and we really want to make sure our workspace is like set. So I know that the office isn't going to be a project that we finish in this vlog just because we're literally like painting the walls and we're doing so much in here, but definitely setting it up with supplies and organization will be a start. So I'm going to show you guys what it looks like right now. All right, so this is what the office looks like right now as you can see 
there's just us because we don't really have much need for an office right now not all of us i keep saying that not all of us have moved in but we kind of want to take this on as a project leslie's doing something really cool with this wall right here so stay tuned for that this is a space that we are working with it's just going to be where all of us can kind of do homework and stuff and then we also want to fit like a table and chairs right here i haven't even shown y'all what i got for this office but i've learned that this place is just the center for aesthetically pleasing school supplies so that's exactly what i got i'm gonna do a little school supply haul because that is all i watched when i was 14 and i don't know where those ever went not 14 like 12. i got five of these little file cabinets i don't know what you call them but basically all of us can have our own and then we can put little files hold on i'll show you we can put little file folders inside of here everything i got was pretty much light pink gold and white so well, that'd be cool if we all had our own so then if we ever get papers or anything we can put it in here let me know if anyone would be opposed to me doing like a full school supplies haul because one i think that'd be kind of funny and i don't know where those went also for our new office space for this virtual learning now if you're going to be online you might as well spice it up i just realized i'm missing two things i don't know if it was on my receipt I forgot to even ring it up. I got really cool bulletin board, but anyways, okay. I got an aesthetically pleasing stapler, light pink. I got an aesthetically pleasing tape roll, light pink. This is all from the brand Poppin. I got aesthetically pleasing light pink pens. And then this thing is also from the brand Poppin. This is my new absolute favorite brand. And look at it, it just holds everything so we can put this on the desk. I thought that would be so cute. I'm just getting really excited about this. I got this little pencil holder which happens to match this one lamp absolutely perfectly. And then these cute thumbtacks, except I forgot to buy the bulletin board. That's my little school supplies haul and now I'm gonna set it up a little bit the best I can. All right, so I picked up this little pencil pen holder from Container Store without even knowing that it literally matches that lamp perfectly. So, okay, so I bought these little, you know, file cabinets so that all of us could put our stuff in them. And I thought that I would put them in these shelves because we don't have much to occupy those, but they're too tall. I thought that I didn't have to measure and that of course they would be tall enough, but look at that. Okay, so right now these are just on this desk. They're not going to stay here. I'll probably get like another cabinet or I'll move them. I don't know, but I'm really sad that they don't fit on that little shelf. Oh, this is another thing that I got. It's from the same brand Poppin. It's just three separate tabs of paper of lists. And if you guys know me, I am a huge list person. That's all I ever do. So we'll keep that there. All right, that is all for today's video. That was a lot. I took on the pantry, the closet, the bathroom, and started on the office. We made our first steps in that room. So very proud and, and I'm very thankful to the container store for reaching out and helping us get settled in a new house. It's so important to have a good environment for where you're living, especially if you're going to be there a lot because of online classes. So also make sure to check off their 20% off back to college deal. That is insane and you will save so much money. That is all for today. Make sure to subscribe if you guys have not already. I would love for you to stick around. You guys can see more projects. But I love you all so, so much and I will see you guys in my next video.